Hello, beautiful people. How are you? <laughs> Hopefully wonderful. Oh, isn't life wonderful? Isn't God wonderful? Isn't this tree beautiful? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. My life's hard, very difficult. I'm trying to stay positive through the, the difficulty. I'd say I'm a positive person going through very, very hard times. I say God's helping me as much as they can on their end, but they said they can't make people help me. They can't make people do what's right. It's one of those things where, <laughs> God, where are you? I just wish people would help. I just wish I could have my life back. And I have these conversations. I know I talk about this all the time. It's with, I wouldn't say God. I don't know what it is, but I beg God to help me. The voice of reason. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Something more than that, though. Reality manifesting. Someone's coming over here. Hello. <laughs> That's a little doggy. Yeah. <laughs> Have a good day. <laughs> yeah, the phenomenon of, uh, I know I mentioned this, uh, someone, sometimes we get angry, sometimes we get upset, frustrated, and we start praying to God. Uh, that's what I did. God, tell me what to do. Because I had no clue how to, how to fix this. They don't think it can be fixed um, because they said, I don't want to fix it, or I would if I could, if it was easy. And people don't want to do it my way. They don't want to just apologize, correct the error. Oh, man. So let's ask God which way. I love you very much, Steve. Make your own decisions. <laughs> they said they don't care. Go whatever way. It's all right. Let's try this way. Whatever. So I wrote some notes down. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm not doing too well, but I'm a positive person, so it's like I can endure it. So this is kind of the... It's not a par maybe irony. I don't know what it is. Paradox, irony. I can endure all this horrible stuff for no reason. There's no reason to do any of this stuff to me. No reason to file down my teeth or put me into mental wards or jails or tell lies about me or put me in a room with a criminal or have me just sit there day after day. There's no, uh, doesn't benefit anyone. So that's why it's kind of dumb to do those things. Too bad there isn't people you can just ask for help and get it. <sighs> but we don't live in that society. We live in a society. People do what they want. I know I've said that so many times. But that's what they tell me. I have conversations with the supreme voice of the universe. We're talking about this woman, Shelly, about how she just makes all these dumb, they don't want me talking about it. But if she calls me, can I say that or no? Should we just lay it down for, they said, lay it down for now, just leave it alone. Is there something funny in here that I, well, let's talk about how I used to see the world. How about that? And they're going to let that. I used to think that uh, truth was like a puzzle. And I've, I heard other people say this too. Like we'd solve it. We'd figure it out. We'd put it together. Oh, but it's more like everyone's got their own puzzle. And they're all solving it, you know, in their own belief system, their own way. Um... And they talk about doubts. It's like, do I have the right puzzle? <laughs> Let's try doing a different puzzle. 
let's mix all the puzzle pieces together. Maybe we'll make something interesting. I saw someone do that once. They put uh, a bunch of different puzzle pieces together. Looked interesting. So maybe that's what I was doing. Yeah. Um, they, come on, let me see it. Mind jackers. Ha 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 ha. I said that in the last video. I don't know what to call them. I don't know if they... they it's more about what benefits me. Because they said no one cares about your thoughts. You know, they care about how you're talking and looking and being in the world and all that stuff. I, I'm out, But I'm interested in what people are thinking. So I'm interested in all these little things like that. That's just how I am. But most people don't want to talk about their thought life. But unless they've had a, a change, then they talk about it. Something that changed it. Yeah, they had a joke with the... My thoughts are racing, and then they'll put this thought in my head. Like cars are racing, or uh, <laughs> these two, like, figures are like, all right, let's race, you know, thought A, thought B. <laughs> let's have a race to the finish. They're not... Uh, trying to get to a finish line or something then oh yeah they <laughs> was it the gone i think it's called the gonsfield effect and you put something like some kind of white light over your eyes but there's no detail and then like a a droning sound and you could hallucinate and i was doing this and like they're like it's not a good idea, but all right, we'll do it. So they were just kind of having fun with me doing that. Uh, uh, Odie and Garfield were there. <laughs> having fun with them. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles showed up. And they'll do the voices and stuff like that. And the guy from uh, what's The Shining, he says, I corrected him. <laughs> like, that's like the voice. I was like, yeah, that's like them. It's like... They're correcting me. I corrected him. He was wrong, and I corrected him. But they can also kind of mess with me because they know what we believe, so they can say, especially when I was going through the enlightenment process, that was a lot of messing with me because they know what you believe, so they feed you the things that you're going to buy into type of thing. Like I'd, and I had a lot of, and it's real too. It feels real because you're having conversations with these people. Um, can I say that? I mean, they said I could. Talk about how like I never had relationships with women growing up, but you know, so I had conversations with these women. Yeah, just about life, and just, it's in the it's in the uh, mind interface. Had one with, they had me one with Joe Rogan. They're like, why do you want to be on Joe Rogan? They're like, fine, we'll just... And they're like kind of punishing me with it because they're... Oh, <laughs> the way they can do that. <laughs> yeah, I'm not... <laughs> yeah, and they did the Hal voice. I can't do that, Dave. <laughs> Uh, I need you to do something more. I can't do that, Dave. It's only dip, you know. So every time and every bottle been falls in the meeting, you know, it's only dip, you know. You know, pirates with the header bin and you know, other things like that. It's walking around. <laughs> it's another way to talk. Really, Beth Buckley, Dr. Lars, his fellows. Eric Baldwin talks like that. It's only the you know, it's just all like that, you know. Talks like that, you know. Let's see what else I wrote. Let's see what else I wrote. Yeah, I said, why can't you just start talking to everyone? And they said they have to want it. So, because I feel like I'm not going to be able to get any justice. I'm not going to be able to get any revenge. I'm not going to be able to do anything to these people. I just see it like... The, other people can basically do whatever they want. 
with no consequence. There's no karma. There's no heaven, no hell. They're not going to be punished. I know people say, let God sort it out. <laughs> I Like they'll be punished in some other world. It's like, but I want people to just correct things now and make things right now. My hands are frozen. I wrote something about my dreams, but... I wrote something about my dreams. I had a dream with you. I had a dream with you. You were so wonderful to me. So wonderful to me. See, I don't feel very good right now. And I don't know what to do about it. I worked on a juggling video last night. But I say like, it's like my energy is like, I, I know I've said this before, it's hard for me to get up and then, oh, I usually don't want to go to bed at night, so. Yeah, and they don't just jack my mind. They got this energy thing on, on my chest or they can make me feel dizzy and they don't like where I live, so they, they increase my re, uh, my it's like sensitivity to sounds. So it's like I if I hear even a door slamming, I jump. Yikes! Dang, 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 da, dang, 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 dang. Hello, baby. I haven't done an impression video in the world, but in a while. Haven't done one in a while, but maybe I can do one soon. I don't know. Kermit the Frog here. Yay, I love going outside. I want to do the rainbow connection. Let's see if they'll let me do it. One in the internet provider. One that stable and secure. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> he turned into Pee Wee Herman for some reason in that one. That's the thing, the more impressions you can do, then like they all kind of, you find all these similarities and all the impressions. But then you do them and you got a mind interface. And you do, who do you do? Morgan Freeman, the voice of God, Morgan Freeman talked to me. And he told me, son, you don't sound anything like this at all. They put, he, he shakes his head at me in the mind interfaces. I don't sound like anything. <laughs> I've said that before. I don't know how accurate they can replicate them, but um, can I say that? Yeah, I was having a conversation with uh, Dr. Hawkins too in the mind interface. They had me had a lot of conversations last night because I, I was just laying there in bed. Man, and it's for hours and hours. See, I need I need better things to do with my life I, than just trying to sleep it off, rest it off. Because I had that saying, like, if you get injured, you're sick, you know, you just want to rest it off. Here's some deer. They're very dear to me. Crikey, look at the size of that one. That deer is absolutely huge. Maybe he'll come down and talk to me. Come on. Probably not. Crikey, these deer are huge. Yeah, I, I don't know how many, see there, let's see if they, I don't know how many times I said life was unfair because of this woman thing that bothers me. Yikes, nobody wants to talk to her. I don't like, it's not like she's, I don't think she lives that far away, but I don't have any way to get anywhere other than take a bus or I guess don't know where she lives. I haven't talked to her. They said that's the... I have lots of conversations about that stupid restraining order. How, like, other people can, you know, beat someone up. And <laughs> they won't even put him in jail for that. 
Meanwhile, I say hi to a woman I haven't seen in 12 years. And we go through all these things of all these things she said. and Because uh, they said, well, she does all these dumb things. Do I want to get in that? We, I could say something about her. Yeah, if you call someone up and you say you want to get together and talk, especially if they that person wants a relationship, then they think that that's what you want to talk about. But then she would never, ever answer that. What did you want to talk about? No one will ever ask her. And she doesn't, you know, she's really weird. She doesn't tell me to leave her alone. So that's, she doesn't say, oh, I don't want to talk to you anymore. <laughs> the last time I actually had a talk with her, she said she'd call me sometime. So, but we know how that goes. There won't be a call. But I did say a prayer, even though I'm, like I said, when I talk, the voice will say, uh, we don't think that does anything. See, they changed me. They gave me a dream once where like they're, okay, let me ask them if I can say that. They don't think I should. But let's just say I've had many dreams with her and like they try to get me to get over her. You know, like she's, she's gone, she's dead. And I'll just cry about it. I don't know. See, it's so stupid. But that's... I thought we were together in past life. I was like, that's like the only explanation that made sense to me. But they also say... Uh, there is no... You know, that's what someone believes. See, there's how you feel. And then... Because I just felt like... When I was with her, it felt like I was at home. It felt like I was home. But they're telling me she didn't feel that way. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yeah, they're talking to me right now, so. It's a nice day out here. But obviously you can't, it doesn't fix the problem of pain, suffering, misery. Uh, if you're depressed, they're, they're, they're helping me though. So, I mean... But they also tell me there's nothing here. Nobody will help. They don't want me making these videos. I don't know how long I'll keep doing them. I have no clue. I didn't even know I'd, <laughs> this. I didn't even think this was even possible. All right, we're in the God Tunnel. God, if you're here, please help. I hear a booming voice. Booming. Kind of a little echoey in here. We're at 18 minutes. 18 minutes of me walking around. Wish I could make it more exciting for people. And I wish I was... See, that's the whole thing. It's like there's stuff I don't want to deal with. This is kind of the paradox in life. I don't know. It's not a paradox, but whatever. And you don't want to deal with it. So then it just goes on and on and on. No one else wants to deal with it. They want to say, we just threw them in a jail, therefore problem solved. Or whatever. Or we told them, get over it. They're problem solved. We told them to get over it. <laughs> so if I haven't gotten over this woman in 18 years, if someone tells me, just get over it, it's like, gee, I would have got over it like, you know, uh, do I have to explain how I am with women? They say you don't think I should. Okay, say something general then? Okay, general, like uh, there's like an attraction thing and then um, if it doesn't, if it, it go, that goes away eventually, I don't know. Just an attraction thing. <sighs> but if you love someone, like that doesn't seem to go away, I don't know. But then they also say that there's not, they said, don't, oh, don't always say that. 
they said they have things you want, but it, it's not like a thing. Yeah, they're talking to me about love. You know, what is love? You know, it's, you love pizza, you love uh, dogs, you love your wife, and you know, all these different sayings we have about that. But they're not all the same, obviously. Agape. Let's look at my notes. It's nice and warm right here in the sun. We're out in a nice little country gal. We got a little country gal out here. See, I'm a, that's the thing. Like I would, she'd be kind of cold and then I like, I'm funny. So I kind of warm it up. Yeah, when I first started talking to God, I'd say, yes, ma'am, sir. Cause I'm like, what is a guy, girl? What is this? I don't know how to respond to that. Here comes some, let's see if we can juggle. Come. Hello! <laughs> Hope you're having a great day. Yeah, you too. The juggling balls. Don't think we're getting them up today. It's unlikely I'll just meet someone and something uh, will hit off. Um, I've <laughs> it's hard to even make friends. That should be a lot easier. We have to do something for these ladies. Let me just, I'll do some impressions or something. Let's, let's see what happens. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Hope you're having a great day. <laughs> let's hope everyone has a great day. Someone will say, how do you do that? I, I don't know. When things work out, I guess. When people aren't uh, doing mean things to you, that tends to help. So let's see what I wrote for my dreams. See, something was sealed off. These doors and like people couldn't get out of them. It's, the doors were screwed or something. I, it's, they didn't want to give me interpretations on this stuff. And uh, there's something with fishing. Yeah, no, no interpretations on this. I think it had to do with some kind of choice. And there's a cruise ship. It's trying to see Shelly. And then uh, some, it was something about some kind of formal thing. But this guy's like, he didn't want to fully dress up. It's my dreams are so weird now. They're changed. Oh. All right. Um Guess we could Talk about uh, uh, spirit moving people's bodies. So I could use a Ouija board, but it'd be kind of pointless for me because I, because <laughs> I my my body already moves. See, for them, it's like shocking to have their body just move or something. They're like, "How is it doing that?" To me, I wouldn't be shocked at all. And then I got the the voice talking to me, and they'd, they'd be joking with me. So. So it's a little, a little different for me. Um, they did move my cursor. I had a video uh, where I said spirit moves cursor. They can still do that. Yeah, it's just different for me. Uh, because they wanted, I they said I wanted the belief system that would represent the truth. But the problem is people are not gonna believe it. <laughs> They're going to believe in the heaven, the hell, the angels, the demons, whatever, that I'm talking to a demon. Whatever. Who knows? But they also said people will believe whatever they, if they want it. They always say it's always about what they want. 
but uh, I don't know. I guess they, if I said people are convinced, they said no. And they also said there's no, there's no like incorrect belief. It's not like if you believe in heaven and hell, it's like false. But they said, I know I've said this before, that my belief of waiting till the next life, just going to wait this one out. <laughs> they said, that's not a good, uh, it wasn't helping you, benefiting you. So, so like. If people have anger issues, then it's good to be forgiving. But they, the type of person I am, I just want people to make things right. So I guess our belief systems kind of line up with what we want. Can I mention that religion? Yeah, so there's a... a can I say that they don't want me talking about that, a certain thing, but there's certain, uh, let's say there's the scripture in the, okay, they said just it, just in Mormonism, there's scripture. Scripture they, is probably okay, who knows, I don't know. But then there's like practices that are, uh, they make videos about them, I saw them, and <laughs> uh, not too bright, I don't know, but that's just, part of the belief system I guess and I don't like making fun of people and ripping on their belief system <laughs> hello <Hi. laughs> hope you're having a great day Thank you. we're not juggling for people so I don't know that's they're not telling me to do it either they're saying keep your balls to yourself we're at 27 minutes already they do correct me a lot. I'll say something and they're like, don't say that one. Don't say you love everyone. Don't say I hope you have all a great day and you're all wonderful. <laughs> I wish it was more entertaining. I wish I was just doing entertainment and I wish I was just having a life and I wasn't out here complaining. But I complained to the people I thought would help and they didn't want to help, so... And I'm terrible at uh, the working the internet, and uh, it's stressful for me. I made a video once, a short video, and you, in a short video, you can't get all the context in. But most people don't believe you can go to jail for saying hi to a woman you haven't seen in 12 years. So. And they said you can't but they can get a restraining order. Anyone can at any time. Hello. Hi. Have a great day. <laughs> yeah, she wasn't as happy, that lady there. 28 minutes. 28 minutes is my favorite time. I don't know why I picked 30 minutes. I don't know if they say, why do I pick 30 minutes to do this? I don't know, because I figured every everyone can, like I can usually uh, listen to someone talk for 30 minutes. Uh, if it's like two hours, I'll be like, I don't know if I want to listen to that. So let's think of something very special to say. That I love ever. I've already said that. Um, I don't think I can do juggling right here, but let's try. Let's try one. Since there's no people, we might as well just try some juggling for you. And that didn't work. Everyone sees my juggling videos anyway, but. Uh, takes a lot of practice, you know, no matter, you know, I did practice a lot, but there's the easy videos. Sure, I could do the easy video, <laughs> one take, but 
do the just simple tricks do the one take or i go let's try something a little harder especially if it's in the dark <laughs> that's going to take me a little bit more than one take it's hard to catch things in the dark even if they're glowing you know dancing and singing they said say one more thing and then shut this off because we're at 30 minutes um something interesting not about religion they don't care um usually I like to think about something i just watched like a video about how like the now i see the internet a little bit it's like infotainment kind of thing it's like why are people watching this video hopefully it's entertaining hopefully they're hearing a little bit of perspective on my life i don't but it's like uh yikes i i don't want to tell people to get off the internet but it's like I probably, you don't need to watch most of it i don't know but that's just how i am i'm just sitting around uh, i wish i was doing something productive they say don't wish just do but i say if it was easier i'd do it so i guess that's kind of in the conundrum my man but that's what they say if you there should be help, but who knows? Like I said, I'm a positive person. They're helping me stay alive, but uh, not good, folks, not good. Had a dream with Donald Trump once where he came in. Came, he didn't give it directly to me, $10 million. And I said, yeah, that's not getting that, but uh, I guess this is... The enlightenment stuff and all that. The enlightenment experience. The mind. I don't know. See, that's the thing. I don't know if it's punishment or. Because uh, I said I want everyone to get. Because then they have to be corrected on everything. See, if you got mind jackers, I corrected them. <laughs> I'll just start correcting. Look at this guy. Look at this. We close it on this one here. Is he gonna slide down? Slide down, slide down. Have a great day. Alright, we'll close it on that here.